In addition to the two of us, we have a daughter named Annalise and a dog named Izzy. Annalise, who we often call Annie, is four years old. She's very sweet and kind and thinks about other people's feelings. We live in a small town in rural Minnesota. Our town is built around one of Minnesota's 10,000 lakes and we are lucky enough for our backyard to be right on the lake with a dock. Our home is situated right in between two large parks which are both less than five minute walk from our house. We feel our community is a great, safe place to raise children who are accepting and loving of those who look different, speak a different language, eat different food, or celebrate different holidays. We have friends or neighbors come over for a meal once or twice a week, which is usually followed by a backyard campfire with s'mores in the summer or board games and ping pong inside. Gathering around a table and enjoying a home-cooked meal together is a wonderful tradition that we are carrying on in our home across four generations. We also have a lot of family fun on the lake. We enjoy cruises as a family on the pontoon boat and Annie especially loves jumping in the lake. This is the same lake that I grew up on fishing with my grandparents and tubing with my siblings behind my grandpa's boat. These are the traditions I cannot wait to carry on with my kids in the future. Tyler is a chemistry professor at the local community college and teaching allows him to slow down a bit during the summertime. Aaron is an immigration attorney, a small business owner, and an elected member of our public school board. She's frequently featured taking a stand for her beliefs in our local newspaper and TV, where our daughter can watch her being a leader and making change that's positive in the world. Tyler and I moved from the East Coast, where we both went to college, back to my hometown to be closer to our families and so that I could begin my career in immigration law. Shortly after moving home, we were thrilled to learn that we were expecting. After a high-risk pregnancy, we knew that Annalise would be our only biological child and that we would look to adoption to grow our family further. Honestly, we've always been interested in adopting, even before my pregnancy. We could not be more excited about adopting a child. I am so fortunate to have Tyler as my lifelong love. He is my biggest cheerleader and supporter, and it makes it possible for me to balance both motherhood and a career. He sets a good example for our kids as he embodies respect, humility, hard work, and love. Most of all, Tyler's family is his number one priority, and it's shown through his dedication to us day in and day out. Erin is an incredible mother because of her selfless dedication to our family. Erin's priority is always placed on others rather than herself. She has a clear set of values and makes everyone around her into better people, especially her family. I can't wait to see her be an amazing mother to our growing family. I'm not sure who's more excited about adopting a child, us or our daughter Annalise. She is going to be such a loving, caring, and nurturing big sister, and we can't wait to see her fill that role. We've got a lot of love to give. Including an adopted child in our home will complete our little family. We are so excited for the adventures that await.